Good morning, Stephanie Cameron, the Stock Whisperer, here to tell you the whisper of the day. But before we get today's whisper, you know it, we got to talk about yesterday's whisper. Yesterday's whisper was hot. If you had a chance to listen to it, we were bullish still on oil, on USO, love trading the stock, trades perfectly on the levels. We were bullish above 1050, and this thing keeps going in fact pinky pinky rocked this for like 60 cents swing on that fantastic pinky also we had our eye on twitter love the pre-market price action that is my biggest secret as you all know that i got to see at least a hundred thousand shares pre-market and that tells us where the big guys are lined up to buy and sell and uh, if you recall we were bullish above 1975 20, 20, 25 was another target. This thing kept going and my traders were rocking it. The cowboy was rocking it, but Roy was rocking it. But the trader of the day goes to Foxy Roxy. She was smoking hot yesterday. She was rocking Twitter, VRX, CRM, JD, TWLO. If it was moving, she was rocking it. So fantastic trading, Roxy. Uh, so what are we watching today okay well got my eye on uh, stocks that have earnings vips is one uh vips had some earnings and watching a lot of price action on the 17 level there is resistance at 1750 so i'm bullish above 17 uh with uh, target you could see it already hit there uh, post market yesterday uh, we could retest that level but if it breaks below 17 i am not bullish anymore on it okay so keep an eye on that level atvi we have some really big prints it got crushed this morning down two percent but there's a lot of price action you can see right here on my block trade indicator forty dollars and fifty cents two hundred and fifty thousand shares another fifty thousand right here so we're going to use it as a marker and be bullish above bearish below no thinking on that one so yesterday we got some pretty big prints on a xlf let me show you those yeah it was pretty rare that we got these guys um a million 1.2 million 24 uh, another million 24 and this was a closing order right around that so that's big print so we're going to be bearish below 24 xlf as a financial etf but we also got some prints on bank of america yesterday at that 15 level pretty big print so we're going to be watching those two in conjunction going to be bullish above bearish below no thinking you can see bank of america trading just shy of 15 so those are very big levels to watch come watch me trade along with my fantastic traders the job for trading room at www.thestockwhisper.com happy trading everybody